this is Helen from Dotty Fish. Helen, congratulations on being shortlisted as a finalist in the Exporting Small Business of the Year Awards. I take it you're feeling very, very happy. I am very happy. It's very exciting. It really is. It's, it's an award that actually means a lot to me because it hasn't been an easy journey, but it's one that I'm very passionate about. And I love my business. And this is just really the icing on the cake. Oh. Exciting times. Yeah. So tell us about the business then and where you're based as well. So um, we are a baby shoe business. We're based in Farnborough in Hampshire. And I set the business up, um, well, it would be nearly 14 years ago, when my little boy was born. And someone bought me some little baby shoes, which I loved. They're just little soft leather shoes. But they were so expensive when I went to buy them. And I thought, oh, I'm sure I could do this. So um, I went online and I drew a few pictures. And um, I found someone overseas who I could order some from. And I just ordered... 500 pairs and started selling them online and then it really you know went from strength to strength um, through the internet obviously because I am an online business um, I was able to we expanded you know expanded into the garage and then I got my first offices and yeah it's just really exciting and it seems that there's a shoe for all seasons with all your obviously, products obviously yeah. you never have too many shoes let's just get that straight <laughs> talk me through the different looks that you've got well I mean we have lots of looks I mean obviously you know in the summer time we've got all the sandals at the moment our suede slippers are really really popular and we're constantly changing our designs and I think that also goes with our countries you know for instance you know we do a lot in Germany a lot in Italy different countries like different colorways or like different products and it's about knowing your customer and thinking well hang on a minute you know the German market like these colors more let's what can we do and thinking about our customers. As we've moved on and I've got a bigger team, you know, there is a lot of work that goes on and it's something we constantly work on and I quite like that, it's nice. And they don't just look good as well, your shoes, do they? Because oh. you've, you've had them tested yeah, too, no, haven't you? Yeah, we have. So we did a lot of work with the London Podiatry Centre and it was amazing actually. We took all our shoes and they had these little babies, little toddlers, and they put sensors on the children and they ran up and down on um, pressure mats and they used gait analysis. And they looked at all of the footage afterwards and they actually said, the podiatrist consultants there actually promoted our shoes and said, yes, these shoes are you know, great for your babies because a lot of children wear shoes that are not the right shoes, they're too heavy on the baby's feet when they're developing. When did you first start selling on Amazon? Um, so I started selling on Amazon, it would have been around six years ago, and I originally just started on Amazon UK. Um, again, because I didn't think I would have the ability to sell abroad. I once got, I had an email, I think, from Amazon saying, do you want to sell abroad? And I thought, well, can I? <laughs> and, and I was like, yes. And I can't even begin to tell you that. I never forget, you know, the first few months, I, I'd made like 15,000 euros in a month on Germany. And I thought, oh my goodness, my life is, in those days, I was like, my life is going to change. It was so exciting. <laughs> I was like, what holiday could I go on? <laughs> so how's the export side of your business really grown since you've been selling on Amazon? Massively. There is only one answer to that question. Um, we export now about 80% of our turnover. I mean, it really is. It's a life changer for me. It's changed a lot of things. I mean, we were always doing well, but now it's opened so many doors. And the opportunities, you know, like I say, Germany, Italy. We've just started selling on Amazon Australia. Um, you know, the world is your oyster. Yeah, the huge is, impact then. Well, yes, because, I mean, and that's the thing, you know, technology today, Amazon, I mean, who doesn't buy from Amazon? And what do you love most about running your own small business? So I love, there's lots of things. I love the fact that I can spend lots of time with my family because that's really the crux of why I started it. I wanted to be with my children. And I love my, you know, all the girls who work for me. They've been, we've, I don't really have a very high staff turnover. We are really a family and I love to share my success with them because it is very much, it is a joint team effort it's not just me you know I came up with the idea and you know okay in the early days it was just me but a lot of people have helped me get to where I am and I never ever take that for granted and if you could look back at your younger self what yeah. advice would you give yourself my younger self well I think actually one of the things would have been not to be scared of selling abroad because I really genuinely didn't think I'd be able to do it 
I really didn't, you know, and I don't think I realised the power of the internet in those days. You know, I was just thinking, oh, I'll just sell it online a little bit and I might pay for a few holidays. And even my husband, I don't think, ever thought, you know, we'd get to where we are now. And we're in the festive season now, and we're oh, up to Christmas. Yes, I know. Uh, and is there going to be one particular product that you think is going to do well for you over Christmas? Is it, is it the Robin shoe? Well, the Robin has done really well already. I don't think there's just a one shoe, because like I'm saying, it's, it's, you know, every country has its favourites. And slippers is obviously popular now because of the cold weather. But that's the great thing, isn't it, about selling online. I love it. And it's obviously going really well for you now. I'm really enjoying yeah. it. Yeah. What does the future hold for you guys? Well... I mean, that is the thing, though, isn't it, with selling online? There can be no limits. They really, and that's what I love. And I know you might think that's really cheesy, Helen, but I really do, because I just think you can never, you're never going to get to a cap, you know, where you go, well, that's it now. I've done my bit. No, there's another country. Yeah. <laughs> there's something else. So Worldwide always... domination. Absolutely. And I'm like all for it. <laughs> um, so at the end of the day, this is a competition. There is a brilliant prize at stake. I know. What would it mean to Dotty Fish to win? Do you know what? And, and I'm being really honest now. Just being here today is, is a lot for me. It's a real, sort of real big recognition for all the hard work that I have and my team have put in. It's been a long journey. You know, it's been 14 years. And like I say, I started off on my living room floor. There were, as much as I smile now and I glamorise it all, there were a lot of very hard times, you know, and, a, and, and times where I thought, oh my goodness, can I carry on doing this? And I'm so glad I did. And I think to win this is just someone saying to you, Helen, you've done a really good job. Keep going. As a, as a boss, you, as, as someone who owns their own business, you haven't got a manager saying, well done. You don't get a lot of recognition. When I got the email, I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh, it's like one, it's, it's so exciting. And I don't take it lightly. I really don't. So thank you. So obviously we can find you on Amazon. Can we find you on social media too? Yes, you can. Um, you can find us on Instagram at Dotty Fish and Facebook at Dotty Fish Limited. Well, listen, great to meet you today. You. And yeah, good luck really... with it all at Dotty oh, Fish and with the competition. Oh, thank you.